In this question, a bird has a steady westward acceleration of 6.5 meters per second square and starts with the initial velocity of 12 meters per second east. Therefore, we have v initial is 12 meters per second east and a for the whole time is 6.5 meters per second square west. Part A, they want to know the acceleration. Now the acceleration is actually given, right? Acceleration is 6.5 meters per second square west. That was an easy one. Now in B, they want to know the displacement in 7 seconds. Now there are several ways of solving that. As we know we have a constant acceleration, we can use one of our formulas. Uh, let's say we look up and we find the formula for change in displacement is V initial times time uh, plus one half A T squared. Now for that we just need to define what's positive. So let's say east is positive and west is negative. Therefore our displacement is 12 meters per second times 7 seconds plus one half times minus six point five meters per second square times seven times seven second square. If I look at the units to check if my formula is right, seconds go away, end up with meters, second squares go away, end up with meters, therefore my formula looks right, and I can type it in. 12 times 7 minus 6.5 times 2 times 7 square. Oh. I have to divide it by 2. Minus 75. On two five meters. As I said that west is negative, this means that my bird ends up having a displacement of seventy five point two five meters west.